morning. Uh, today I have my helper Elena with me and Addison is my uh, videographer. Um, so we're going to review suffix s. Now we discussed that suffix s is the s at the end of a word, making it mean that there's more than one. What is the base word in this word, Elena? No. What is the word? Bug. Bug. Thank you. We call that base word. We pretend that suffix s is not there. This is the base word. The base word is bug. And by putting this s on the end, mean that there's more than one bug. So what we also learned about suffix s is that this s can make two sounds. It could say s or it could say z. Okay. So let's look at this word. This word says bug, bugs. Listen to that suffix s at the end. Does it say s or z? Um, Elena, what does say, when we also say um, words with suffix s, I like to say base word and then base word suffix s. So I would say bug, bugs. So I would like you to do. Bug, bugs. Good, does it say s or z? z. Very good. Bugs makes the z sound. This is what it sounds like. Base word first and base word suffix. Mop, mop, mops. Good. Mop, mops. What sound does that make? S. S. Very good. Kit, kits. Good. Kit, kits. What sound does that make? S -s -s. Very good. Shells. I mean, shell, shells. Good. Shell, shells. What sound? Z. Z. So we know suffix s can say s or z. So on your homework today, I would like you to practice and to listen to that suffix s whether it says s or z. Thank you.